scary. Hi, this is Shauna Shepherd, and I'm going to teach you something to make that's good for your kids and for yourself. What you will need is one egg, four carrot chips, break them into small pieces. So they'll look something in that nature. Then you will take a jalapeno pepper. Notice I've used this one already for the one I made me earlier. And when you cut it into small pieces, you will have small pieces like this. I suggest you cut it with a knife. I use a butcher knife because that's my favorite tool. Um, then you take the sausage. It should be about a quarter size, like that. You take it and you make it into a patty like that. Then you put the Welber Gourmet Booger Seasoning onto your sausage patty. Then you take your bread, which I use Walmart bread or Wick bread. And the Walmart bread looks like that that I use. Why don't you give it a try? And then you put, when it sure. comes off with the toaster, oh, then you put the Miracle Whip right on. I use a plastic spoon mouth. if I have one. If not, I use a regular spoon. Mm -hmm. Then what you do in your skillet, you put your veggies into it. And then you take your sausage and you break it into pieces. Your pieces should look something like that. And then you take your egg, you crack it, and then you put it in your pan. And then you take your parsley frillings, your smoke house maple, you take your paprika, and then just put a little bit more of your Welber Gourmet Booger on it. Then you'll take your spatula and you will stir it in your pan. And then you will put your egg, like I said, in it. Make sure it's all completely done. It takes around 20 30 minutes to make it. Depending on how low you cook on your oven, I usually do the low setting. And then you put it on your bread. After you've mayonnaised your bread, of course. Notice this is not mayonnaise yet. And then you take your sausage and you put it on your bread. And it should be all done, so you should have your vegetables and your egg. And then you put it on a saucer, or you can put it on your piece of bread on the saucer. And then you top it with the second piece. And you've got a pretty nummy sandwich that your kids will enjoy. Now, if you are allergic to any of these ingredients, they can be substituted. Um, your egg actually can be substituted for those egg white beaters. Your sausage can be substituted for anything you eat during breakfast for your meat. Your carrots actually can be done with your favorite vegetable. Um, if a jalapeno is too hot for you, use a green or red pepper. Or just use the pepper seasoning that you can get, which is usually red crushed pepper. And there you have a really good sandwich. Now, if you don't like paprika, don't use it. If you don't like parsley flakes, don't use it. But your favorite on the sandwich is going to be your gourmet booger. Yes, I said gourmet booger. And smoke.
to be the ones that you want to use the most because they will make your sandwich taste awesome. Thank you for watching this and have a good day.